Hey y'all, in today's video I was at Good Guys Columbus 2024 and I ran down Mike Rudder's 1979 Crew Cab Chevy. And they never made these things, but Mike made one. It's very cool. Let me get the camera turned around, we'll check it out real quick. Well, we interview now, Scott. Why? I just don't like it. He won't be on it, it's to be your audio. But Talking's not good? Uh, that makes you nervous too? Oh yeah, I get nervous. I'm not gonna my pants. No, don't do that. <laughs> You're not gonna get mad at me did, for telling the whole world about your truck and your story. No, no, it's just that I grew up on a farm and I learned to drive in these trucks. We, right. My daddy farmed and that's what I learned to drive in these trucks. And it's what I took my driver's license in is a truck like this. So we always had a vision to build one of these trucks and I wanted one of these trucks. So we, and we, what we did is we tried to build a truck like GM would have built this truck. You know, it's all the little stuff that it's got all the modern conveniences that we thought GM would have made this truck. You know, they never made this truck. They never made a short bed crew cab truck. They were all long beds or were all duallys. So how did this start out? Started as a uh, three quarter ton long bed truck. Okay. And we shortened the chassis, um, changed all the running gear to half ton, got a GSI front suspension and it's a 79 model truck but a 79 model truck had a gas door on it and from my days of working on the farm and all that with my dad i wanted a gas cap because we pumped so much gas through a cap so i wanted a cap on it so it's like a 76 model bed it's all original gm sheet metal there's no aftermarket sheet metal on it anywhere it's all original gm fenders original that's an original gm hood so you got the parts and then made the chassis to the size you needed to fit those parts, yes. basically. Yes, we took a... Took so a that's a real quad or four-door truck from whatever year. 79. But they never made that with a short bed. So you combined it to the, 70, the 79 short bed? It's a 76 short bed. Okay. Which they were all the same, right. except a few little minor details in them. But yeah, yeah we took the chassis and shortened the frame, changed it, like I said, put all half-ton running gear on it. It was a really... a a C20 truck when it started. Is that where it sits or is it on air? No, that's where it sits. It's static. Man, that's nice. What, what motor are you running it's in? It's got an LS3 376 525 hot cam motor in it. And you're a, you're a calm guy, so what made you use that plaid insert in the interior? That's pretty loud for, for somebody just, that's... I just like to look. So understatement, I just, yeah. I just like to look. So I just like the way it, it's just one of those things. I seen it and I thought, man, this would look great with dark blue and... Right. It's one of those things that'll make you remember the truck too. Yes, sir. You know, because again, I think you know, a lot of people won't realize they never made that truck. Right. Right. They'll think <laughs> that that's just a quad cab, you know, that they mm -hmm. lowered. Yep. And, and a lot of people don't notice all the body mods that's been done to it. You know, the crew chief emblems are one off. The door panels in it looks factory, but they're all 3D printed. Um, just th there's lots of little bitty subtle modifications done if you're a c10 guy you notice but if you're just the average guy walking by it's just a truck but you left the mirrors and door handles and door locks and all the obvious stuff that most people would shave off you left all that on yes that's, that's that was what we were chasing to make it look like this could have been actually made and come rolled off an assembly line I know. well man i think mike killed it do you yes yeah yeah very pleased yeah brother what a cool truck thanks for giving him some time today hey thank you See, that wasn't terrible, was it? Nah. So there you go, from the 2024 Good Guys Columbus event in Rudders, Rods, and Customs, a very cool 1979 quad cab short bed pickup truck. How cool is that? Hope y'all have enjoyed it. See ya! Hey y'all, make sure you subscribe to this channel and visit scottydtv.com for an easy way to search the hundreds of videos I have posted. Either click the link in the description or the one at the end of this video.